Marimbo, Mande Marimbo. Me que puta naranja, Mande. or major geography is moving positively towards reducing the number of people without access to water. In Africa, the situation is in reverse. Over 354 million people are estimated to be without access to, uh, to water. So there is a real need. There is a case for Africa. A case for Africa as a continent, a case for governments in Africa, and a case for a company like ours, which is a water-based company. So I'm, I'm excited very much about that. One of our recognitions as a company, as a foundation, is that no single organization can stand up to Africa's uh, social challenges alone. This is a partnership-driven model, and the partners are not only the ones that implement. The partners are also the communities that have the needs. The vertical here in Dumira, what they have been doing is uh, on water and sanitation uh, issues. And uh, Lumira is part of the Wami water basin. So it was a bit necessary uh, in one way or another to assist uh, the school and at the same time to make sure that the environment within the water uh, basin of Wami is well maintained. So for this particular village, uh, the thing which was very well appreciated was the build of the school toilet. Uh, and actually there was a time when this particular school, the Lumira school, was about to be closed because of lack of a sanitation uh, facility. <laughs> water is very, very difficult here. If, if we want water, we can water far away from here. The, the children drink the water which are not boiled. Mm. For example, they go to the river or the, they, they catch the, the rain. Tunakuja shule na chupa zetu za maji. Tunaeka maji yenyewe. Tusikia kiu, tunakuja. Kwa sababu tukua tunapata shida sana, tunaenda vichakane kujisaidia. Sasa tuwa pata hivi vyo, tunashukuru sana. Sasa hivi ya tuna shida yote. The toilet facilities were built, not only the ones donated by the water partnership, the community went ahead and built another block. So they can do it, they can mobilize resources, they just need a trigger. They just need a trigger and uh, for me that's a best practice of enablement and of sustainability. <laughs> Welcome and meet the group. This is Chibane Group. Before it was uh, like a, a, a national cultural group, and it was in, in, based in Dar es Salaam. But later they, they said, okay, in cultural development, why can't we form the school? So they shifted the group coming to Bagamoyo, and this was in the early 1980s. The school is helping very much to develop culture, Tanzania culture, and being like ambassadors to send our culture in the world.
when you send the message, sometimes it depends how you send the message. You have to create your message in a way that is attractive. It's not like punishing. It's attractive and then it's, it's sweet. And then it dissolves in the mind quickly. In the music, when you cry out, everybody listens and they understand in a minute. One of the things that we are trying to do is to uh, inculcate sustainability. Uh, we are not going to be uh, donating money. We are enabling communities to be able to improve their own lives, to take charge of their own economic destinies. And they are capable. They just need uh, uh, sort of like a missing piece in the link between where they are and where their dream for economic empowerment lies. That's the bridge that we are providing. We are Chanchi Jai Vinya, 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 Chanchi Jai Vinya,